Being born on the Jersey Shore 58 years ago, I have been taught the Italian culture, and I feel that I'm more than qualified to teach you all the Italian cuisine your heart desires. It's time for cooking with Catherine, bitches. Actually a seat. A strainer, because I'm into bondage, don't judge me. A big red ball! And a little bit of pot! No, not that kind of pot, you fucking hippie. For the first step, we're going to need to boil a little bit of water. It doesn't really matter how much water you put in your pot to boil, as long as it's enough to soak the noodles. In fact, speaking of water, I'm a little bit parched. until it's el dente. It's pronounced el dente. You shut the fuck up! Meanwhile, I'm gonna start making the sauce. And to do that, I'm gonna need half a cup of milk, a little bit of cheese, and three... We'll be right back after I take this quick smoke break. God damn it, where's my new ports? 
Now that my sexy bitch sauce is done mixing, let's drain the pasta. <coughs> For this next step, most people use tennis rackets, coffee filters, but I myself like to use a strainer. Now, as much as I love wet things, it needs to be much drier, like myself. Next, you're gonna wanna pour your dry noodles into the concoction. Concoction. Co who say co cox? Concoction. You're gonna mix it up. The heat from the noodles will actually cook the three eggs in here. Next, you're gonna wanna take some salt and some pepper and add as much to your liking. I myself like a lot of salt and pepper, but you might not like as much. And now, we have ourselves a delicious meal. This is a personal kind of fucking dish. It's for you and your family, or just you, I don't really care. But it's whoever's fucking eating at the table. You can put any kind of garnish you want on it. It can be spicy. It can be sweet. It doesn't really matter. But you have to make it personal. And just like that, our meal is complete. This concludes this week's broadcast. <laughs> Until next week, my little pussy farts. Go fuck yourselves!